Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for April the 21st of 2021, well, it is titled Centaurus A's Warped Magnetic Fields. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image taken uh, or partially image taken by the Sophia spacecraft of NASA. And that is a flying plane that observes in the infrared. And it can do that by getting up above most of the water vapor in the atmosphere. Now when we look at the infrared, we can look at the polarization of dust, which allows us to trace the magnetic field and to give us a much better idea of what is going on here and to figure out what's going on with the magnetic fields. And we're seeing an unusual clashing of two magnetic fields. And that's because Centaurus A is actually a combination of two galaxies that are in the process of colliding. So we see a elliptical galaxy as the whitish glow around the whole area here. And then we see the dark dust lanes of a spiral galaxy. And these two galaxies are in the process of colliding. And what that does is that feeds more material into the black hole. And then material spirals out in the two jets that we see going out up towards the upper left and the lower right. So big jets of material going out. And we can then uh, see what else is going on. It's actually been amplifying and enhancing their magnetic fields. And it's really going to give us a better idea and a better understanding of what things were like in the early universe. Now how that works is that collisions were much more common in the early universe. First of all, galaxies would have been closer together because the universe is expanding. And there would have been far more galaxies. And they would have been smaller and there would have been a lot more collisions. And we actually believe that collisions like this are how galaxies have grown over time. So in this case, we actually are looking at a number of different regions. We look at the visible in the white. Uh, the submillimeter in orange, x-rays in the blue, and the infrared is the reddish red colors that we see. So when we look at the magnetic fields, we see that they are around the dust lanes in certain areas. But when we get down to the center, they're significantly more distorted. So that the gravitational forces around that black hole are actually uh, helping uh, and changing. So the collision between these two galaxies is something that we can look at and begin to understand how galaxies evolved in the early history of the universe. So that was our picture of the day for April the 21st of 2021. It was titled Centaurus A's Warped Magnetic Fields. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.